Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to Carpo Gaming and another Borderlands 3 video. Alright, today we have another awesome weapon guy for you. Now, this one is pretty freaking cool. I'm talking about the Loaded Wild Carbine, aka the Carbine. Now, this is a Jacob's weapon. It is epic and the only reason why I'm showing you this is because this is a beast. Now, this weapon absolutely looks amazing. And it's actually a Gatling gun. Can be compared to the Lair Sprinkler or the Becca. Actually has quite some good stats as you can see right here. We have 1,343 on damage, 66% on accuracy, 60% handling, 2.7 on reload speed, 4.96 on the fire rate, 14 on the magazine. We have 10% crit hit damage, 26% weapon damage, 21% weapon fire rate, 4.5 weapon zone, and yes, it is anointed. So while terrified, you gain increased crit damage and the more terror you have, the higher the bonus. Now, where did I get this weapon? Well, I got it from the heck hole while I was farming and I got it from one of the badass goals so this is very very random and to get it anointed perk on this it's really random so this is a great week to get it we have increased skulls actually for today with the new hotfix so it's actually very possibly you can get this bad boy today so there it is the loaded wild carbine now what makes this weapon freaking amazing is that it's actually a gagging gun like I said it can be compared to the Becca or even the last sprinkler but it actually does a little bit more damage as we about to see right now we're going to take this into Captain Hunt Mayhem Mode 3 and we're about to show you how much damage we're going to get during the first damage phase of the boss fight and I'll pop the fade away and as you can see right here the numbers on here are amazing 26,000, 28,000, 29,000, up to 56,000, and you can see right here in the video, it's pretty freaking cool, with or without the crit buff. So I said, okay, it did get there. Let me take it into the cistern of the slaughter and see how well this is going to perform against some fleshly targets on Mayhem Mode 3. So I went into there without any of the extra buffs or the fadeaway, and wow, it's actually really, really good. Look, this weapon is a beast. It's actually really fun to play with, and you can actually get some pretty long kind of sniper scope type of kills with this weapon because of the damage that it does and because of the scope, and you can actually get up close kills because it's a Gatling gun as well. So it's very ambidextrous, and it's actually good in all game modes. So definitely get out there. Hopefully you can get this to drop. Like I said, with the increased ghost goals that's being applied today with the hot fix, it's a great time to get this. So I said, okay, one more time. Let's go to the proving ground of the cunning because they have some very high level enemies may have mo3 and they have lots of shields and as you can see right here yeah it's really good so by far this is one of the better weapons regardless if it's not legendary it's an epic but it performs better than some of the legendary counterparts this being a Jacob's assault rifle yeah it's pretty badass. So yeah, that's pretty much going to end it for the video, ladies and gentlemen. As always, if you are new to the channel, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. And hey, if you really want to help out the channel and a video, you can do so by liking a video if you indeed like the video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And don't forget, I upload daily Borderlands 3 videos. So turn on that bell notification and stay up to date for more Borderlands 3 videos. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.